Hey everyone, welcome to Team MSRV, where we show you life is not over just because you have MS for you or your caretaker. And that's why we decided to sell everything and enjoy life to the fullest. So follow us on our adventures for tips and tricks on how to cope with this disease on a daily basis. And maybe we could help each other. Hey guys, today is a beautiful day out there. It's clear, it's um, windy. It's, windy. it's kind of chilly today. We're in Virginia now. At the Walnut Campground. Walnut and Hill Campground. Walnut Hill Campground, and it's in Staten or Staten? Staten. Staten. We don't know how to pronounce it because no. we're from North. <laughs> <laughs> so it's spelled like Staunton, but I heard someone say Stanton locally. So that might be a thing. Yeah. And then we're going to Shannon Day. Did I say that right? <laughs> See, I'm tired, so <laughs> I have give me fun a with break. that. Yeah, <laughs> so it's Shenandoah <laughs> National Park. We're gonna go on Skyline Ride, or yeah, Skyline Drive is what it's called. We did try to go yesterday, but the the road was closed. Online, it said it was open, but when we got there, everything was closed. Yeah, those gates. I mean, I don't think they wanted us to push that open. No. <laughs> so we turned around. Um, but that was, yeah, so today we're going to be meeting um, Mikey and Robbie up there and we're going to kind of all experience the park together. And I think Robbie haven't been there before. Yeah, it'll be a first time for Robbie. But Mikey was there, he did go I think he before. just cruises up and down there as yeah. a commute route Yeah. because <laughs> he just loves it. So that'll be cool. That will be fun. We probably won't do many videos uh -uh. or any at all. But we, we will do. take pictures though and then we'll show yeah, it to you guys. Fun. Yeah. So yeah, we'll check back in and let you know how it went. See ya. Bye. Hey guys, we are back from our adventure today. Yeah, we did the Shenandoah Valley National Park. Um, we didn't do the entirety because it's a slow ride and um, we had other things going on as well. But we did about half of it, maybe a little bit more. Yeah, we did take a lot of pictures too, so we'll share that with you guys. It was so nice, you know. You're cruising around the road and you're up on like the, the summit or the ridge line of all these mountains that are kind of interconnected. Mm -hmm. Um, we were watching some stuff about history of the place where it used to be all farms and it was like clear cut and now it's all forest again and it really was really nice very nice yeah what was your favorite part of that place when we stopped and there was uh, the bridge or not the bridge but the wall stone yeah and then you like you could see it going down or oh, where it was like close to the edge yes and I made a funny video going ah, I'm falling oh yeah <laughs> that part was pretty it was they really may have nice. seen that already oh maybe <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah that was fun and I just like how the depth you know I think um if I remember right there's a chemical or some kind of agent that gets released from the, the trees there called like I think it's isoprene or something like that I'm sure someone out there will correct me down below in the yes. comments um, which is the best way to get information yes. online give the wrong information right. they'll fix you um, I believe it's isoprene or something similar to that and like when you see a lot of it accumulated in the air it like looks bluish so that's where the whole blue mountains things comes from it's actually blue Percolated tint yeah. yeah and it's really yeah. cool and I like the further back it goes the the bluer and hazier it gets yeah it's just something about looking at far distances that's relaxing, you know, and it makes you feel like you're a small piece of this giant world. It's beautiful. But it we should probably talk about, um, you kind of ran out of energy. Yeah, I did. It was like, I was trying to concentrate and then keep looking and seeing and I looked at Frankie and I said, 
I, I'm done. I'm like... She just ran out of gas. And, and so you know, like the circumstances, we were chilling out, relaxing. We were, I was driving. Yeah. Um, we had Mikey and Robbie in the back of the truck, you know, in the back seats. And we were just kind of cruising around. You know, there's cars in front of you. It's a national park. You really can't mm -hmm. go fast. And, um, you know, I think it was 30, 35 you were doing through all the curves. And you weren't walking or running or anything really like that. No. It's but just I think it's just... So much to uh, see Yeah, you were sucking so it, much in. Yes, and it, I don't know, it just hit me like going like, I just crash. Yeah, like you gotta organize all that stuff, so... Yeah, but it was fun. But that's, I think that that's why we're sharing that, is that that's part of what MS is. Yeah. You know, you, you have a plan, you go to do something, and... Um, you start doing it, but... Sometimes you have no problems right through the end. Yeah. And then other times, right when you get there, you already feel the effects starting to wear on you. And then I'm like, okay, check out time. It's time to it's, uh, yeah. change gears. Yes. And we're not blaming the ending of this trip on that because we know it was something else um, we had to do. But we just want you guys to understand that it could happen. And that's just, you know, like, don't get frustrated, right? No. Don't get frustrated because that gets worse. Like, if you you see you would get frustrated, I would like stress out more. Yeah, which would, would trigger more symptoms. But what's nice though, that ticket that we got there, we could use it in seven days. Like we had a set, like we could go again if we want to. Like tomorrow or the day after, yeah. we want to go back and do the other part. Right. That's true. I I, I think that's for all parks, all national parks, but. Yeah. That was our first stop at the first one. Yeah. So we're happy. Our mission is... It's working. It's starting, it's, you know? It's starting, and, yeah. and we're actually doing the things that we planned on doing. Mm -hmm. The whole purpose of this is not to just live out of a camper. No. But it's, it's to good. experience America. And, and enjoy your life. Yeah. yeah. And see a bunch of national parks. Yes. I mean, neither of us have been west ever mm -hmm. still. And uh, that's going to change. Yeah. <laughs> so... That's all we want to share that information with you guys, and Shenandoah National Park is a win for us. Yes. Um, there's a lot of hiking too, if that's something you were interested in. I, I want I forgot about that because we didn't do any of that really. Um, but yeah, there's trails on the right, and all that. there's all these parking areas. Seems like you should get there earlier because a lot of them were full. That's true, yeah. But it looked like it could have been a lot of fun. It was good for me that we didn't have to walk because <laughs> it was full. <laughs> but maybe I want to go back and do a little yes. bit. I mean, so we'll find out. But anyway, that's about it for this update. Um, Walnut Hill Campground, by the way, it's a nice campground. It's beautiful. Where we're at, we're up on top of the hill. Yeah. They have like this nice little pond on the bottom. It's still off season though. It is. So off season meaning there's no pools or no activities or. But there is a disc golfing over there. A small par three disc golf course. Yeah. Nine holes, but yeah. we have discs. We're gonna go try it out. We suck and have fun. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's better than just kind of sitting there and marinating. Right. You know, but you do that too. So, but I did want to kind of give a shout out that Walnut Hill was pretty. It's pretty nice. Sometimes the wind might catch the farm next door the wrong way, and it's it's you just, it's country. You yeah, yeah, you can't do anything about it. We no. don't hold that against them. No, the park, the the campground itself though was pretty good. You know, the sights weren't too tight. No, where we were though, we weren't compressed, but it's because it's not the season. The, I it think. was off season again. Yeah. Um, but the prices were reasonable. I don't yes. want to ever give numbers because this video will get dated. Yeah. But the prices were reasonable. Um. And I can imagine in the summer, it's a great place to bring kids. Oh, yeah. I mean, they have a nice playground. They have walking. Swing. They have swing. Yeah, they have yeah. A, a big pond for fishing that has bass in it. Yeah. So, that's pretty cool. Mm -hmm. So, shout out to you guys. We had a good time there. Yes. Um, and we're still there. Right? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> so, shout out to you guys. We really like it here. Yes. And, uh, and yeah. I mean, I think that that's a... That's a wrap. Yes. All right. Peace. We'll see you guys next Bye. time. Bye. <laughs> Thanks, everyone, for watching. Use our playlist to watch our video in order. And the best way to support us is to like this video and subscribe to our channel and get notifications. Don't forget, 25% of any money ever earned on this channel will be donated to an MS cause of your choosing. As a team, we got this.